the brain or the storybook to play. Hippocampus. We're going to the hippocampus. I miss hippo. The hippocampus helps you remember things, like where you put your favorite toy or shoes. Play. How do you know where you keep your clothes? How do you know how tall a flower grows? Because of your memory. And what helps your memory work? Your hippocampus. Let's play memory match. Easy. Click a card. Then click another card. Find a match. It's a match. The problem is Phoebe Cerebellum isn't working. If we don't fix this, Phoebe won't be able to dance in the school talent show. Your brain has different parts that do different things. Messages from Phoebe Cerebellum need to go to the other parts of her brain. But look, the messages are stuck. That's why Sarah is losing her balance, which means Phoebe can't dance. Move the sparkling message through the maze to the blue shoe. Yay! You got the blue shoe! Now get the red one. Good! Hit the brain clouds to get more brain power. Time. Put on your thinking caps and play with me. Put on your thinking caps, count one, two, three. Cerebral cortex is my name. Thinking and planning is my game. Boys and girls, put on your thinking caps. We have a mystery to solve. Your cerebral cortex is like a thinking cap. It helps you to think and plan and solve mysteries. Listen, things are hiding in the neural forest. Look closely and click a leaf when you see it move. It's a baby hippo. Listen, there are more. The hippos can go home to the hippocampus if they're able to slide down the slide, but the slide is broken. Click one of the pieces of the slide. Move the piece to its place on the slide and click again to unlock it. Good fit! Hooray! Now the hippos can go back to the hippocampus. Click the lever to start the game. Which one has a brain? Ducks can sleep with one eye open and half their brain asleep. One has a brain. A spider has a small spider brain, but it is able to learn. Hop on board before it. 